and there's been a lot of media focus. I've been doing a lot of uh, talking about myself, which is you know something that I'm not you know really used to. Uh, I've done it in Buffalo a little bit, but they've all heard all my stories, and now uh, you know. I don't know, apparently more people want to know what I'm all about, so it's a little different. And uh, I don't know, just trying to uh, stay positive with that and embrace it a little bit because I, I feel like, you know, not looking at it as a chance to promote myself but promote the game. It seems like the fans who tune in to, during the Olympics but may not turn in uh, t turn on hockey during uh, the NHL season are the kind of people who want to know more about people's personalities and they get really into that and that's kind of what we've been seeing. What are the one or two things either on the ice during a game or off the ice during the experience that you will most cherish about being in Vancouver? Honestly just being in a locker room. I, I thought all the American guys were great guys. Uh, we came together real quick. We all were very positive with each other, you know, given the games did go pretty well for us. But uh, I thought part of the reason they did go well is because we all were really pushing for each other and we all wanted to uh, see, uh, you know, team success through uh, guys stepping up. So. I just really like being in the locker room and, and hanging out. And then you get back in your first game in the United States, you get a huge ovation in a visiting city. Does that give you a handle on how much your performance meant in this country? Yeah, it's a little surreal. You don't usually expect that, but uh, it was it was nice. Uh, it feels good that they appreciated the uh, you know the way our team played and uh, you know for my my role on the team, uh, you know it felt good that people. Uh, kind of look past, you know, what team I play for, you know, coming into an opposing, you know, I think that uh, says a lot about, you know, you know, the American, uh, you know, public more than the American fan, you know, like people, uh, people were talking about our team and, and it was a source of pride and, uh, you know, it was, uh, that was a big positive for us, you know, we've, something, you know, a lot of the guys really felt good about. Uh, being mentioned in, in, uh, in circles other than, uh, you know, the standard sports page. You might actually get that reception here tonight at least once. Would that be a surprise to you? <laughs> yeah, that might be a surprise. Um, I don't know, but if it, it can happen at Spurry, I guess it can happen anywhere. You know, they're pretty pretty loyal fans there, and you know, obviously New Yorkers are, uh, you know, have a reputation for being a little more brash, but uh, they're they're loyal too. So we'll see how it goes.